I've just been on I've just been on stick cam for a while and I was gonna make a video and then I was not gonna make a video and then I decided just now you know what I, I might as well just make this video I don't know why I'm afraid of it maybe because of what I want to talk about because it's pretty extreme um, first off I want to talk about Obama and not no I don't this is just an idea that I want to pose to you Barack and to really anyone that's listening right now but I want to put webcams in school systems in like kindergarten so that the children can communicate with children in other countries uh, over webcam and, and understand each other and fucking break down this imaginary barrier that's surrounding the countries, these borders that don't fucking exist <laughs> they don't exist it's, a, it's all a human construct, it's a concept all these people are the same and we all have different languages and cultures and stuff and we're all the same so I want to put the let webcams in uh, in the kindergartens and first grades and second grades and let these people communicate for an hour a day with another person in another country. Let them learn each other's languages. Let them ask each other questions and, and understand each other. And there is only, there's a webcam and there's no fear of, of any wrong question, of any embarrassment. You just ask. Let the children explore the concepts together. And, and that will happen. Um... Also, I was thinking about creation and, and humanity, and, and someone was asking about like what we are as humans and how we'll destroy ourselves. And I think that we, the consciousness, we are creating this whole experience. We have created it to be as it is, and we have we have chosen these bodies and this human existence and these brains and before we chose dinosaurs because we thought the best way to evolve would be to, to be, to exist as big animals that will survive and we did and we for millions of years the dinosaurs survived but then we realized that we can't get off the planet the dinosaurs aren't, cannot evolve to a point where they can leave the planet they just exist on the planet and so we realize we can't get off the planet. This is the extent of our evolution now, and we wiped ourselves out. We wiped out the dinosaurs and started again with a new race, with a physical body that is weaker, more, more able to be destroyed, but a more intelligent thing with opposable thumbs to manipulate primates and then humans, what we are now. We've created these humans. We, I mean, we are humans. We have created these humans so that we can evolve ourselves more and so we are now we just think we get to a place where we don't have the wild animal tendencies of fighting and, and getting angry and we just think this technology is built to help us think and so that's pretty amazing we're helping ourselves to evolve with this technology that's what technology is it's a large part of evolution. You take it with you. If the technology was all wiped out, we would be back a thousand years ago. They were still thinking the same things, but they were not able to communicate like we are now. That's the thing. We've technologically, we are technologically able to communicate over large distances with many people at once. We've done this. We've put ourselves in this situation. We've built this to be, and now it is. And now we just continue. I don't know, man. It's up to us what we do. There's no more violence. The violence is a thing of the past. I will take the cockroach in my apartment outside, as I did, and let it free, and then find no more cockroaches. I'm not going to destroy it and throw it away. Be kind, use the internet, and I suppose then that just shock waves out through humanity, and more people are kind. The internet, it's like a, it's like a fucking network. It is a network. You plug into the network, 
and you experience the network. You see all the things on the network. Okay, that was all I was thinking about. I guess it's better that I put it on video. See ya.